So chat last week, uh, the James O'Keefe stuff came out with the, what's it called again? The senior vice president, Michael Giordano. And uh, I guess there was a follow-up video that came out a couple of days ago that I haven't seen yet. And uh, this comes to us from X, James O'Keefe right over here, confronted the Walt Disney senior vice president, Michael Giordano, is confronted by James O'Keefe and James O'Keefe uh, and, and O'Keefe Media after uncovering Disney's discriminatory hiring practices. The situation intensified when one of our American swipers confronts Giordano's about having a tickle in his throat to avoid seeing her. Oh, he ghosted her. Damn, not ghosted, but you know, like, oh man, I'm sick. I can't go. While on a date with the other Amer- Oh my gosh, so the two girls, the two girls that James O'Keefe got set up to go meet, uh, to go on a date with him. Oh my God, man. Both journalists lead the scene as O'Keefe enters the stage to question Giordano. Caught off guard, Giordano fled to his car with G O'Keefe tailing him. The scene at Sunset Plaza didn't go unnoticed. Hollywood influencers, ex huddy uh, Kiara Hovland and Nick Nyam, who witnessed the entire incident, praised OMG for saving the city and pledged to check out O'Keefe Media Group. Oh my god. Oh my. Video quality. All right. So 720 is the highest. All right. Let's go. All right. Let's go. <laughs> Hey, that girl is pretty cute. All good. You don't care if my girlfriend comes to pick up uh, my key fob, right? Okay. Oh, hey, babe. Hey. Hi. Hi. Damn, that's sort of messed up. Yes. Wait, do you guys know each other? Yes. <laughs> we are. Oh, wow. I... You told me you had a tickle in your throat. Oh, man. She's pre they're pretty cute. I can't see the face, but they're pretty cute, right? Is your name, uh, there we go. Giordano? Maybe. Do you work for Disney? I'm not gonna. Is this you right here? Oh, damn. I'm not. So, um, Got him. So, Sushi, uh, I think I know what that is. Are the vice president of the Walt Disney I know Company, what that is. And you're on tape saying that you don't hire white males. Oh, Whoa. damn. No way we're hiring a white male. There's no way we're hiring a white male, Mitchell. <laughs> damn. Are you the vice president at Disney? Got caught. Do you know Got about caught. Title VII of the Civil Rights Act about discriminating against people based upon religion and race, sir? Quote, I'm not looking to bring on any more clients who are white, you know? I hear all the time, like, uh, you damn. Know, I'm looking to hire writers and actors who bring diversity. I'm not looking to bring on any more clients who are white. Disney is concerned. I'm a white male. I have friends in HR. Uh, Mike, who are your friends in HR? <laughs> He's, not gonna, not, He's not gonna say anything, man. He's not gonna say anything. My friends in HR and I have friends in those yeah. divisions. Do you think that being quiet is gonna help you? You don't have authority to put me on tape, but uh, I will put you on tape, and I do have that authority under the First Amendment. You know, just because you work in Hollywood doesn't give you entitlement to discriminate against people on the basis of race. Follow him. Giordano. Follow him. He has a model ass. Get him. <laughs> Sir, he's got the Tesla. He's Let's see if we can catch up to him. Yo, he's faster than LA traffic for you. Discrimination <laughs> on the basis of race, Title Seven, the Civil Rights Act. Oh, I know exactly where that is. Sunset Boulevard. Oh yeah, I know where that is. I always get my exercise with these guys. Whew. Oh man. Damn. Yeah, he was uh, he was out of there on the New York Minute. He confronted him and he <laughs> drove away in his Tesla. Very upset. Uh, the two girls confronting him at the same time. Apparently, he lied and told one girl that he has a little itch in his throat. We have someone gesturing. To, let's see what happened. This guy works for, for Disney, and he was discriminating against people in the hiring process. Oh. And he was on a oh, date, man. but it wasn't a date. It was an undercover per person with a hidden camera. The vice President of Disney sat right next He's to you. He's the Vice President of Disney. You bet, yeah. What's his name? His name is, his name is Mike Giordano. And so that was like a fake 
date. That was a fake date. And who was the girl? His girlfriend? There were actually two girls. One girl confronted the other because he was lying to one of the girls about the <laughs> girls he was dating. <laughs> so it was a whole... That was a real thing. That was a, that was a real was undercover like a investigation right the there. Yeah, people don't do that anymore. The there were two girls and the other girl made an excuse and then he showed up and confronted them. And Wait, and so that girl was here on a date with him and it was like a setup to get him here? Yeah. Wow. Wow. Not a week goes by without Damn. a news headline about potential medical Damn. supply shortages, threats to our infrastructure, or power grid. Oh, you got them. Hold on. They pulled during the last eight. So we saw this last time already. 30 combos. Order ready. Local emergency slash help. T E E. Y'all, y'all working okay, hard. Working really hard in I Hollywood, exposing it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You guys work in Hollywood? Kind of. Yeah, really? Okay, yeah. you probably shouldn't tell me because I'll. Yeah, have you're... a good one. If there's any fraud you're committing, you know, just be careful, yeah. okay? Oh, you know, sick. I mean, underage. Underage? Yeah. yeah. That's, that's, that's not a bad idea for the next sting, right? Saving the city. Yeah, Saving underage situation. I wonder if that Check relates to a certain yeah. doctor. A OMG, O'Keefe yeah. Media Group. OMG, okay. OMG. Okay. Check it out. Thank Check you. it out. All right. Saving the city, you heard it here in uh, yeah. Sunset Plaza in. Los Angeles at the Le Petit for exposing the discrimination. He ran away in the Tesla, almost <laughs> ran over your foot. You had to be real careful. He's not a happy camper. Stay tuned. Disney part one, part two, and three coming out soon. There is no cow too sacred That's so for O'Keefe good. Media. Stay tuned. How you doing? What happened? Oh, this guy, vice president of Disney, was caught in an undercover state. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Exposing the corruption, you know, that's what we do. How you doing? Sorry, well, I didn't know you guys were still filming. I said I was a big fan. Like, oh, you're a big fan? Yeah, yeah, I didn't know we had fans in L.A. <laughs> yeah, nice. To see you. nice. James. Sergey. Sergey. Nice yeah. to see you. Yeah, Disney. Nice. Vice president. Oh, wow. Exposing Hollywood. See, we still have yeah. some good people in L.A. I'll, I'll be uh, looking out for it. Stay tuned. We still have some good people sure. in L.A. There there it is. Uh, right. Sergey. Nice. Oh, man. You love to see it. You love to see it, yo. That okay, so it makes sense. Basically, after that confrontation, he's like, I need to freaking nuke my LinkedIn account and because I'm gonna get fired for this. Like, oh my god, dude. See, we need yeah, yeah. Remember actual journalism? Yeah, man.